Welcome to our art channel. Today we will talk about the painting called Allegory of Painting by the famous painter Francois Boucher, created within the year 1765 to 1766. Francois Boucher was a French painter and proponent of Rococo taste, known for his idyllic and voluptuous paintings on classical themes and decorative allegories representing the arts or pastoral occupations, intended as a type of two-dimensional furniture. He also painted several portraits of his illustrious patroness, Madame de Pompadour. Boucher's two allegories, the allegory of painting and the allegory of music have been associated with each other since they came to light in the late 19th century. Virtually identical in size, their compositions are well balanced and their subjects complementary. The low viewpoints of the two paintings and the broad handling of the brushwork suggest that they were intended as overdoers to be placed high in a decorative scheme where close examination would not have been possible. In each picture the arts of painting and music are personified as beautiful young women surrounded by attributes appropriate to their arts and are doted on by winged putty representations of naked children who are engaged in playful activities. I hope you have learned something else today, a hug and long live art.